Hello guys, this is Warrior here, and we are back with another realm of Left Lorien Let's Play. We are starting to see what Isengard does. It looks like Isengard is going to retake Adares and then swing in and try and do something with me. But they may push an army down to deal with Mordor proper. Not entirely sure. We did see at the end of last episode that Mordor has a large full stack right here. So I'm going to pull back Celebrom and join up with the reinforcements, yes, then push south. Might as well push with uh, everything that I can muster. Um, everywhere else, we're kind of just building up some troops. Uh, here, I did see that we can get some other units, so we will. Get as many as we can recruiting. Because we're not that far from our main lines. Uh, scouts. Get as many troops as I can in. But... We are at the end turn, so let's end turn and see what happens. There we go. Sounds a little off for some reason. There it goes. There we go. Sound is definitely a little off. <clears throat> the episode that will be up before will be an hour long, and uh, I don't like making them an hour long, but... Uh, yeah, it's just how it played out. I need to see if I can find a recording software where I can split up the times. Like cut the video in half and then do it two way because the software that I'm using now doesn't really allow me to do that. Um, I could cut half of the video off, but then I would, I'd lose the other half. So Anyway, I'm sure there's a way to do that, to split it into two. And then go back over and voice record, but it's a little extra recording that I do not have time for right now. Lemire is ready to upgrade. Alright. Move that to the front. Yes, I know. It'll increase squalor, but that is good. That means it is increasing rapidly. Let me whack the taxes up just a little bit more. And fine. Negative growth. Getting that in. That'll help. Merchant's Quarters would be nice. Hall of Culture would be good as well. Need an armor in first. Get me that Elven Plate. That will allow me to get some more heavily armored units out. <clears throat> allow these guys to be out on their first armor tier anyways. Alright, we are doing... Hopefully that doesn't pop up. Um, Alright, so they sent that force there. They got more troops coming on in. How's the siege going? They're continuing to siege it down. Oh, hello. There comes Mordor. Okay. So they're about to get... They're in a real fight right here. And they're sending some troops to keep me occupied. Okay. Elven warriors. Be vigilant. That's fine. Light of I can entertain that. Me. Okay, so they pulled back, so they do not want to fight that, which is good, because we are going to force them to fight it. Take all of you. What do they have? Nothing to, to concern myself with. Could I auto-resolve that? Three to two, really? It's because of those ballistas. Whack it down on low. Do I have any cavalry that I can use? Oh, you'll stay there. Uh, I will have some cavalry down in three turns. Right, we're going to have to fight this. And we're going to have to hold there for a while. I got that feeling. We're going to have to hold in the... Uh, in that area, let Mordor and Isengard duke it out and me deal with their scraps, essentially. Which I'm okay with. I'm definitely okay with that. I can hold my own against one opponent. Okay. Um, drop your Halberd stance. It's going to be absolutely useless in this. We 
We have a lot of archers. Which is a good thing. Alright, so we got... These all archers? Yep, these are all archers. Alright. Run forward. You four run forward as well. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Six times it. No, don't do that. Shift to the left. Go. There we are. You. Attack the vanguard. You move left. We have them trap. You move left. Take their U4. Archers. U5. Crossbows. We'll swing on around and engage those archers. The battle is very much in our favor. Victory will well, be it's out. always going to be in our favor. Just got to quickly chew through this ballista crew. What's going on over here? The Vanguard are dropping pretty quickly. Actually, very rapidly, because they're running up against armor-piercing units and um, solid infantry units. So that's always good. They're getting decimated by archers. That's what I like to see there. Not so much. We've broken through over here. Flank around. You make sure they start running. We are faster than you. You'll do know that, right? They should have held their ground and fired their ballista off instead of trying to move to a better position, I guess? Not entirely sure. That is a lot of archers coming on in. We should slice through them. Come on, quickly. Only half the enemy force remains. Quickly. I would have lost way more men if I would have stood my ground and fought this. Chew through them. There's a lot of arrows coming in. Charging his back. We have it on times two, which is fine. How are we doing over here? Slowly grinding them down, which is also good to see. They're getting cut down by arrows. And this is not going to end well. Not going to end well at all. Come on. How are we doing? They're almost dead. Let's six times it. It's dead. To them, you move forward. Stop firing. We did lose a few, but not a lot. They're wavering. Crush them. Behold how our Continue. Foe runs. It's time to press the attack. Then we'll end there. Be awed by the Lost 49 troops. Not bad. Not bad at all. There's going to be definitely a slowed down portion to this week for the elven portion. I may run through a lot of turns. Going to have to get my troops down in position and then launch an assault against them. I'll definitely try and get the other two videos squared away this uh, today. That would be good. I'll try to record these about a week in advance uh, in case you're wondering. Um, I will take things in consideration and... Uh, once I get the channel where getting a bunch of views and a bunch of comments, I will slow down on the recording and record a few days out ahead just to ensure that Warden's sentries, what's in here? Warden's. Alright. You tag team up. Join them. Come, my brothers. Follow me. Elven warriors. 
You stay U2 and U2 sentries go back. There we are. Depleted, but I think we have enough to cause some damage. Oh, and then I have this force coming. Hopefully Hama decides to get aggressive and push into here. That would be nice. Or at least they're building up to where they may do something here pretty soon. Aha! Mordor is chasing me. However, I will be able to have a response for him. Definitely a response. So I'm going to wait there and see what this army does. Did I have a spy somewhere? Thought I did. I'll go back to normal. It's not really helping us that much. That unit in will help. These guys training will help. Any more people training? More swords, more them, more march wardens, more just everything. Archers in general need the war machine going. Okay, Follow you. Me. You come. Hmm, don't want you. No, 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 no. I remember. You're coming on over. Because you're going to take the place of him, and he's going to push south with Kelebrimbo. Or I could move him over, because he would be better. Possibly better over here. Got more generals. I need you over here, so. I'm going to move my fraction on, air my down the line. Can I lead? 70, so they should not riot this turn. Should not riot this turn. Follow me. So we'll keep Over moving. Here, no bur mercenaries available in that By region. That's fine. Go there. Come, my I'll add another really good archer slash infantry unit, and we will face them in open battle next turn. Um, everywhere else, Loran, see what's coming. Uh, just troops in their garrisons. Got about a full stack here. Mordor, there's about to be a battle there in this turn. This army, this army is going to try and relieve the siege. They will, and then fight Mazrak, Mazrat, Mazrat. And then keep pushing this way against Isengard, which would be nice. And then I can come in, take Adaris, give it to them. There's my southern portions. They're capped off. And then I can focus on beating back, taking Gennede in these regions, and then go for Isengard. That's my plan. So, it's all coming to fruition. Four turns, I'll have that reinforcements, elite troops back. Um, we'll be delayed a little bit with another group of elite troops so let's Hamas pushing south or attempting to push south doing something we got another Rohan army Prince Swinhelm the defender Swede him Swimhelm Swede Helm Swede Helm my English is impeccable even though I'm a native English speaker it is just brilliant gotta love it what are they doing Ooh, there goes that force. Smash the ribbons. Which is understandable. Now uh, it's going to take them a few turns to get. Oh, Muzrat is falling back. And they're going to regroup and send uh, one force my way. Set up an ambush. Two forces my way. Okay. Moving up more troops. Why are they moving them up against me? They should be dealing with Mordor, but instead they are moving troops to engage me. They're trying to hold off two opponents and we're both like just crumbling them because I can't. And they're trying, I guess they're trying to fortify Gennede, Helm's Deep, and uh, the Westfold. That's what it looks like they're probably trying to do, the AI is trying to do, because it knows it's not going to be able to hold on for much longer. He likes us. It's interesting. We are at war with them, but he likes us now since we're fighting them. Okay. By the light of Elberus. Yeah, you get around. So you have that force. And we will take Elves. this one unit. So I'll face him in open field. Let me see what he has. Take it for the elves. Ooh, really? Five to seven. Let me see what he has. 
Hmm. No cavalry, which is a plus. One troll unit. One, two, three. Three archer units. Some halberdiers, Sauron's wheel. This is going to be an easy fight. But before we do that, because that's going to be a big fight too. That's down the poor. You're the one who's attacking me. Alright, what do you have? Them. We must defend these lands. Just want to know what he has. Engage. Okay. Come, my brother. My lord. Elven warriors. Yes, my son. By the light of Elbereth. Yes, my lord. Elven warriors. Oh, Onward, follow me. Oh, you're gonna stand here and fight, hey? Eh? Alright. Well, we are going to hold off on that one. A few turns, but I'm gonna move all these troops around. You're gonna come back, get retrained, and you're already in here. Whenever you're available, you need to be retrained. You push south. How long until this can be a recruitment area? Let me see. 12%, so I need to get another art gallery. I need to get roads in. That's gonna help. Town guard, practice range. Marketplace stables. I need to get all this going. So twelve percent. So really, get these in. Dead in. That's ten turns. Hall of Music is going to help. We'll just hold with that. That's going to help. All right. Um. Your orders. Okay. Um. Is there anything else I need to do? Oh, yeah. You go there. Yeah, that'll help. I'll help the whole money situation out. Things around. How are we doing here? Not fantastic, but we are growing these settlements. So you don't need a stables. How are we good on elven culture? We're fantastic on elven culture. We'll go public baths, and that's what we'll do there. Leave that there. Do I need those? Not really. Get rid of the town guard, go for these. It at least offers some sort of monetary compensation. Ooh. Here we are. Get these units training. Now, let's fight, because I won't be doing any of that after this, so Take it for the this is the battle we'll use to close out the episode. The fight for Dand Alad. Um, Calibor's defensive line. Let's see if it holds. Wipe the flight from this land. Will the gray line hold? That is the key. Will it hold? I do not know. We will see. I think so. They outnumber us by two to one. Not too terribly worried about it. They only got four archer units. If they were assaulting the siege, I would say it's a it's a easy win because they're gonna do what they always do. They're just gonna rush everybody in, and I can crush it. But in a pitched battle, this is gonna be interesting. Okay, so I want no part of this bowl, and I wish we were actually fighting like this, so they had to come uphill. But that being said. Ballista, I want you out in front. Take away your little... That thingy. We're going to move left and right of the Ballista. You go right. And we'll... Can we... We can't actually... Can we deploy on that? Ooh, no we can't. Okay, so we can deploy... But then there's like a few little sections that you can't actually run up. It's like right there where it's too just a little too steep okay uh, so AI, AI may not here's my faction heir come of age looking really good with the Elizabethan sentinels which are better versions of the Haradrim archers I'm gonna wait both my generals on the right flank my spear infantry are going to be in the center and are going to be the second line you throw your javelins. You three are going to extend out to the left. 
U2. We're going to do like that. U3 are going to undo that. Do that. And I'll probably what I'll do is I'll take these two troops, flare them out to the left. There we go. Ah, Ballista. Who's in range? Shoot them. I don't know why they did this. They they have this all clustered together. This is where the archers are. So that's where their archers are. You three. Stop it. There we go. Stop it. You two do that. You two move to the right. Boom. Oof, that was a good hit. Sauron's will took a, a really good hit. Hit the trolls. If you can. Fire, you idiots. You three. Fire at those who you can fire. You two, is there any archers over here? Absolutely no archers. Alright, fire at those you can fire at. Boom, that just went one troll. That just went another troll. Trolls are dying everywhere. They're dropping like flies. That's what I love to see. Uh, you fire there. Fire there at the archers. Stop it. So another unit of arch. Ooh, they're way back there. Who has the extreme range? You do, and you don't. It's barely there. You're gonna let keep me killing your trolls. I'll keep doing it. Come on. Ooh, that's a good hit. They're moving against me somewhat. Still jostling for position, it looks like. There goes another troll. Ooh. Almost got him. Like Uruk archers. If they're going to keep letting us do this, I will sit here and out skirmish them. No problem. Uh, you know what? Here's what we're going to do. You two are going to move up to this line. You're going to move there. You're going to move there. To the center. You two move up. You two move up. You three shift up. Oof. That's what I like to see. It's good hits. Alright. Keep firing on those trolls. You and you do not fire. Do not fire just yet. Focus fire on them. Alright, here's what we're gonna do. Engage. We will cut through these marauding guard. You do that. You shift in. You two, fire there. We'll win across the board. Sauron's will, you go there. You do not fire just yet. If we continue like this, we will smash We'll smash through those Sauron's will. Keep firing at those ba oh no 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 no. You go there. Engage, protect that right flank. You two move up. Keep firing. You three. 
We're moving them to the right. There they come. We gotta shower them with arrows. You too. Move up now. Move up now. Move up. Ooh, these halberds are really cutting through those guards. You, you got to angle there. You got to angle there. Throw. You shift this way. Charge. Jesus, what's going on here? Come on. Mm, they're attacking the ballista crew. Ballista crew, pull back. Throw your javelins. There they go. Now they're out of the way. Throw your javelins. Doing fine here. The enemy are badly bloodied. They have lost half their men. Well, they should be losing half their men. Fire there. Actually, fire at those Moranian guard there. How are we doing? Doing, doing fine. We'll cut through these. We'll lose some troops, but we're doing fine. Doing good here too. Oh, black orcs are three. Black orcs are through. You go deal with them. All right, I need y'all into the fight, into the fight. Let's crush whatever this melee is. Come on. Get not defensive and actually start attacking people over there. What are you? Fight. Archers and Mark Markwood pull back. All right, this battle's going well. Crushing these not really good spearmen. They're good for... Moran and Guard are excellent spearmen for Mordor. Anybody else? They're about average. And actually, they're probably worse than average, to be honest. All right, so the thin line held. You... Go do something about that. You, both of y'all, go do something about that. So they running? No. Let's go after them. Let's go, let's go, let's go. What are we doing here? Oh, I need more troops here. Uh, you, get in here. You go there. You two, peel yourself back and start. I mean, that's fine. You keep moving. The archers do not need to be going up against halberdiers. Uh, you two move into the center. Yeah, that's their general too. Orcoast is in their general's body. Uh, the, the general's bodyguard is Orcoast. I do I like the fact that we killed one, two, three, three of their trolls um, with the ballista. And then the javelins combined with the armor piercing killed their trolls right here. How are we doing? Are they running? They are running. They are running for the hills. That's fantastic. It's because of those trolls is the reason why. They uh, had that advantage. They didn't have the archer advantage, but they did have trolls. And trolls are really good in the auto resolve because of how much their potential of killing. But they do not have about one, two, three, three units that excel at killing trolls, which is the, the enemy spear javelins. The enemy are 191, 106, 142, 232, 
333 for the Woodland Warriors. Oh, no, Lorian Sentries. 333, 94 for the Woodland Warriors, but they were go going up against Trolls. Only nine of them were healed. Oof. That's not good. I could use more of them. <laughs> and so uh, I'm also watching football while I'm doing this recording. Every now and then I'll just look over and uh, to let you know when I'm actually recording this, in case you're curious, uh, the Cowboys are losing 22-3 to in the fourth quarter. So if anybody n watches football and is also watches this, you will know exactly what I'm recording this. If you do not, it will mean absolutely nothing to you. And such is the purpose of this. Alrighty, well, uh, I'm going to end this episode here. The next episode will kick off with the fight between Alfin, the March Warden of Lorien, against this army, which is going to be interesting, but they have two ballistas, a warg marauder unit, I have one ballista. We've got a bunch of archers. I should be able to beat that uh, pretty handily, but it will be costly. And then I'll have to pull back. I do have some reinforcements coming, so I'm not too worried about it. Alrighty, this is about to be a town, which will be good. Get some more elven culture in, which will be fantastic. Um, actually, I'm going to pull you back. Well, I'll sort that out here now, uh, at the end of or at the beginning of next episode. So, without further ado, if you're enjoying the videos, please leave a like, rate, and subscribe. It really helps the channel out. And I will see you in the next one. Have a good day.